would you like to see if the makeup remover from MAC works? Let's give it a try, review it, and see how it works. Hi guys, my name is Mireya. For this video, I'm gonna be doing a review video and I'm gonna be reviewing this makeup remover from MAC. I've been wanting to try this for the longest time and I'm always on the lookout for a makeup remover that can remove all of my makeup with me having to scrub at my face and I just don't wanna work hard when it comes to removing my makeup. This is a makeup remover that I heard it's good, at least when I went to the MAC store. She told me that it was a very good makeup remover and that it removes even waterproof makeup. So let's give it a try. I have a lot of makeup on, at least I feel like I do because I don't normally wear this much makeup on a regular basis. So let's go ahead and get started. She gave it to me in this little baggie. She was so sweet because she actually gave me a different baggie as well. Look at this, this is so cute. She gave me this bag in stars. I mean, I don't think, I don't buy much things in the Mac store, so I don't think that they give this all the time. I bought three things in my entire life at the Mac store. No, four things. Just four things in the Mac store. Or I've been there four times. And this is the first time that I get like a little bag like this. It even says Mac right here. Look at this, right here. Oops, are you able to see that? You're able to see it right there, it says MAC. I am gonna be using this for possibly my makeup brushes or something. I'll give it some, uh, I'll give it a use. It's similar to that lay and go bag, look at this. Okay, let's get started. This is a cleanse off oil. Comes in a little white box like this. I'm gonna read to you what it says back here. This says, gently massage over face to dissolve makeup. Rinse off thoroughly. Follow with usual cleanser if needed, obviously. Mineral oil free. I always feel like even though you're using a makeup remover, you have to cleanse your face. At least, I like my face to have that squeaky cleanliness to it. Is that even a word? But I like my face to feel squeaky clean. So let's get this opened up. This is what the bottle looks like. This says cleanse off oil. This is a uh, 150 milliliters, 5.0 US, US fluid ounce. And it says the same thing that, that it says on the back of the box, cleanse off oil. Let's uh, get rid of these eyelashes first. Let me put a clip on because I don't like my hair to be in the way when I'm removing my makeup. So let's do a close up. I'm gonna be removing these eyelashes and I usually do not pull them off like this. This is like a bad, bad influence here. I don't want you guys doing that. Because you can tear off your, ugh. You can rip off your own natural lashes and you don't wanna do that. I usually put some makeup remover, but you know what, I'm just gonna rip them off. I did that. Let's put those away. As you can tell, I have a lot of makeup on. I have some wipes here because I don't have water with me or a bowl or anything, but probably go and rinse my face off after this. I don't think that's gonna get rid of the oil, at least I don't think so. Do I have to shake this? I'm shaking it and I don't see the oil. Or possibly it's all oil instead of water and oil. We'll see. The girl that works at the Mac store, she said she uses this to remove her makeup at night and she does two pumps. So let's just give a give it a try with two pumps. I'm gonna put it on my hand here. One, two. It's quite a bit there. I am wearing waterproof mascara today and I did that so I can film this video and do this review video to test this product out and to see if it really works because waterproof mascara is one of the most difficult things for me to take off at night. Also lipstick, but I don't use so much lipstick and if I do, I don't use lipsticks that do a lot of staining on the lips. So I just use more of natural lipsticks or lip glosses and stuff like that. Well, not lip glosses, but just lipsticks that are not staining. Okay, so I don't know why I'm closing the other eye. <laughs> Let me use that makeup wipe just so we can see and tell if there's a difference already.
So this is what we have so far. I don't want to move it too much because I want you guys to see if it really works. I still have some oil in my hands. I also have glitter and that's sometimes pretty hard to remove. So I'm going to use the rest of the oil that I have on my other hand. I did put some lipstick on today, but kind of wore it off throughout the day, so I don't have a lot of lipstick left. Sorry, I'm trying to view uh, view myself on the viewfinder because I don't have my mirror with me. So I have two makeup wipes here and they both have a lot of makeup on them. I'm going to go rinse my face off with water and I will be right back and I'll let you guys know what my thoughts are on this. Okay guys, so I, I am back. I rinsed off my face and I did not use a cleanser yet. I haven't washed my face yet. I just wanted you guys to see that I do have just a little bit of makeup left. Just very minimal. Possibly like under the eyes right here. Very, very minimal makeup. You can barely see uh, any traces of makeup. I'm actually going to give this makeup remover a good rating. From a rating from 1 to 5. I'm gonna have to give it, uh, I think I'm gonna give it a five. And the reason why I'm thinking about it is because I'm still gonna be using a cleanser, which it does say use a cleanser after using this makeup remover. So it's not something that is not like the product is advertising that it's gonna remove 100% of your makeup. You obviously have to follow with a cleanser, which even though if it didn't say to use a cleanser I still would have used a cleanser because that's just something I like I like my face to be squeaky clean I think it removed pretty much all of the makeup even any traces of minimal lipstick that I have you can see my scars here you can see my imperfections and I do have some just very minimal ma makeup residue which like I said I'm gonna be using a cleanser and doing the rest of my face routine at night I'm, I'm pretty happy with this product I am gonna keep using it I don't want to compare it to any other product as of right now because I haven't tried any other cleanse off oil before I've tried a makeup remover in the past but this one looks like it has not only does it have oil but it has a mixture of water or some other ingredients in this product it's not only oil as this product here from Mac if I shake this this up I wasn't able to see that it has any water or any other ingredients like I really don't know I'll have to look at the ingredients here but this one here you can tell that the oil separates from the water that's why you have to shake it up when you use it like I said as of right now I don't want to compare it to any other makeup remover or cleanse off oil because I haven't tried any other oil product like this before. So I'm going to give it a good rating I would say buy it I know it's a little bit on the pricey side I am going to be searching for a cheaper, that something that's more cheaper. And I, once I find it, I'll let you guys know. I just wanted to try it and give you, give you guys my thoughts on this. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Take care, guys, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.